Hello and welcome to Plus Eco. In the last video, we downloaded and installed Epic Games Launcher. Today, I will show you how to download Unreal Engine and how to create a new project. So, let's begin. First, open up Epic Games. Then, go to Library. And here, you can see a plus sign where you can install a new version of Unreal Engine. Just press the icon. Here, you can pick a version. So, actually I have installed 4.25.4 We also have a preview here, 4.26 I really recommend you to go for now with a 4.25 Anyway, if you want to have the latest version, just, just press install and you will see that the download will begin When this is ready, you can see launch here in the engine, just press it As you can see, I already set up a project to test the new version of Unreal because I also had 4.24. But anyway, we will create a, a new one. Here you can uh, load your recent projects. Here you can create your new project. So press games, next. And here you have some templates. Uh, usually you have the blank that is it's clean. But you also have first person, flying, puzzle and so on. Uh, for now, let's go with the blank one just for tests. Here you can select Blueprint or C++. Let's go with Blueprint. It's very useful in Unreal Engine. It's very common. Here you can go with Desktop and Console. With Starter Content. To have some basic materials and objects from Unreal. And Ray Tracing Disable. Here you can set up your location. Where your project will be and your, the name of the project I will create like introduction to unreal plus equal oh, can't, do, can't be that long create project this will take some time to open up especially if it's the first time so this is the default layout usually what I like to do here and we will explore this uh, in a future video, but for now let's stay like this and in the next video we will mess up with the editor UI so just to see if this is working let's here in this panel just press this share and press delete and now our share is gone, right? J this is just to make sure that the project is working so you should see a asterisk here meaning that the scene have changes that aren't, aren't saved so you can just save current and now the icon disappeared let's try and close our project wait a second and epicams will reopen now just go to library you can launch your version or, or just click here in, in the projects in this case I created this one but I will launch the version and now we have here introduction to Unreal that we just created let's open the project, it's selected, you can select the project open project and as we can see our share is no, no longer here this means that the project is good to go in the next videos I will show you how to create new levels and we'll talk also about the editor UI and much much more. So really thank you for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video.